What is the probability of a given object being immortal? Well, mathematically, we might think of the value p as the probability that something might last one year. If p is 0.2 for 20%, then there'll be a 20% chance this object will survive a year. If p is constant, then you will die. Each year is 20% of the last 20%, and this is an exponential decay. However, there is a way around this. If p is constantly changing, if p increases over time, Suppose the object we want to make immortal is data on a hard drive. If we copy that data on a hard drive to two more hard drives a year, as long as all the hard drives don't fail at the same time, that data is immortal. However, you've got to keep this process going and you've got to hope that an asteroid doesn't hit the earth and all the hard drives will be gone. Because when I say hard drives, I mean people. Global catastrophe seems to get in the way of immortality, so we gotta fix this problem. There are two ways to tackle this problem. The first way is to produce many diverse copies of the same thing. DNA. Spread them all around the planet and make them work in different ways to exploit the Earth's energy sources. But if it's a global catastrophe we're depending on surviving, we had better spread farther than this Earth. The second way thinks of the brain as a bit of a prediction engine. An individual organism must collect data from its environment and learn from its experiences so as to avoid death. Humans, it is safe to say, are the best in the world at the second way. We are the best in the world at predicting things. We've developed formal sciences and created technology. We are the product of billions of years of evolution and our need to survive is the deepest thing there is. And yet, we fall asleep while driving a car. We may have a long way to go.